I think before we started the School Vision programme, um, we were clearly frustrated at home. Um, there were reading and writing difficulties, um, language difficulties as well, and homework difficulties. I think um, we've just been around other opticians and other forms of help, and I just wanted something that was clearly defined, and I could see um, there was a purpose to, and hopefully we hoped that uh, Anya would enjoy the programme and definitely gain from it. I think it was just a, wee, a little bit apprehensive at the beginning, um, but more so relieved. It was lovely to have somebody at the end of the phone and Noel himself just to put the human touch into it and to just make me feel relaxed and that we were going forwards. Um, up until then, you know, I feel I felt a wee bit frustrated, um, just going round from pillar to post um, and having different tests carried out and when we came up here just Noel sat and he listened, he went through all the technical things which were above my head at the beginning and uh, definitely assured me that this would be something that would work. I think the initial appointment was very different to an ordinary eye test. Um, the first one was about half an hour long, the second one about two hours long. Quite a few comprehensive eye tests. I think the first appointment we were able to benchmark just where Anya was at and continue through quite a few tests. Um, we were able to follow up each appointment after that, discuss what was needed. Um, and move on and it just felt like a journey the whole way through that we were moving further and further on to somewhere where we, which was a lot more positive um, and at the end we were able to see such progress on paper but it's much more than just paper progress. It has made such a difference to Anya herself, such a difference to us as a family um, it's been a long two and a half years in different ways, just um, almost justifying at times why we felt we needed to do something else. Um, but at the same time, stepping back now and just letting Anya progress. Um, it's lovely to see her now naturally picking up a book and picking up books that her peers are reading and wanting to read. I think I was horrified at the beginning when she came home in P2 and said, I hate books. And uh, to me, as a mummy, you know, I just knew that that was a stumbling block and we had to start somewhere fresh, somewhere new. And uh, this is where we're at now. And she loves her reading and her homework's just lovely and <laughs> delighted with her. <laughs>